Javante Williams played football for four years at Wallace Rose Hill High School, then was a standout at UNC, and now three years later, his dream is becoming a reality. Sports director Tanner Barth has his story of small town success. Javante Williams, touchdown Carolina! Nothing has come easy for former Wallace Rose Hill standout Javante Williams. The 5'10 running back had no Power 5 offers headed into his senior year, but after rushing for over 2,000 yards and 30 touchdowns in his final year in the Bulldog colors, the Tar Heels came calling. But even with the scholarship under his belt, he went into Chapel Hill having to prove he belonged. Coming from a small town, you just got to make the most out of what you got. So I feel like that's, that's what helped me uh, be so successful at Carolina. Like, I'm not used to having too much, but um, I know how to make the most of what I got. So just keeping that mentality coming into UNC, uh, just keep kept my head down and work and did everything I was supposed to do. And Williams did just that flashback to his freshman year where he rushed for 224 yards. Two years later, he's an All-American and one of the best running backs in the nation, racking up over a thousand yards and 19 scores on the ground. He credits the culture established at Carolina and those around him for making him the player he is today. The other running backs in the room, um, I said they're really the reason for my success on the field. Uh, just having somebody like Mike to compete against, who's also a very good player. Um, in the weight room, on the field, and even like in the meeting room, just having somebody to push me every day, um, I feel like that's really where most of my success came from. That success left him with a tough decision as the regular season came to an end. But he returned to the field with his teammates in the Orange Bowl or take the next step towards achieving a goal he's had since he was a child. A choice that wasn't easy, but it's one the former Bulldog can be proud of. And that's chasing his dreams in the NFL. Just talking to my uh, my family and um, it's all a timing thing and just leaving out of it healthy. Um, I think that was like the most important part, uh, not knowing like the risk of getting hurt in the bowl game. And also being that I played a running back position, um, we get hit pretty much every play. Um, just, yeah, just trying to get out of it healthy and put myself in the best situation to see that next level. And while nothing is given at the next level, Williams finds himself one step away from playing on Sundays. He says that hasn't really set in yet, but one day he'll look back on all he's accomplished coming from a little town in Duplin County, proving it doesn't matter where you come from. If there's a will, there's a way. I feel like one day when I'm, when I'm able to just sit down and like just think about like how blessed I am, it, it all just hit me and I see like the bigger picture.